The Carnegie Science Center just unveiled its most ambitious exhibit in its 30 year history called Mars, the next giant leap. The four and a half million dollar project has been two years in the making and replaces Robo World. In today's Kidsburg, I got a first look and asked kids their opinions. Think about what it would be like to live on Mars. What kind of house? How do you grow food? And what future do we choose? Those are some of the many questions visitors are asked to ponder at the new exhibit at the Carnegie Science Center, Mars, the next giant leap. The whole idea behind this exhibition is that we are looking at our life here on Earth through the lens of Mars. Jason Brown, director of the Science Center, says they got questions from the local community and incorporated them into the exhibit, which is already getting reviews that are out of this world. It's a 10 out of 10. I think it's just crazy to see what's beyond Earth. There's endless possibilities to it. There's no end. There's billions, trillions of stars and other planets that could be suitable for life and might have life which would be pretty cool to find somebody else that's not us. Kids love making the robotic rovers travel over Mars rough terrain, learning about the planet and the moon in an interactive Q&A, and seeing how plants could grow on Mars using hydroponics, all of it relating back to life here on Earth. The same technology that we can use to grow food on Mars is, exists to help reduce insecurity, food insecurity here on Earth. Pittsburgh has a growing space industry with Astrobotic building the next lunar lander just a few blocks away and CMU's Robotics Institute. Mayor Ed Ganey hopes this exhibit will inspire local kids to pursue careers in space and STEM right here at home. A new Mars adventure, exploration to Mars, something that I never thought that I've seen in my lifetime. I'm telling you, sometimes I feel like I'm living in Star Wars. <laughs> Star Wars, right? Well, this new Mars exhibit opens to members tomorrow and to the general public Saturday. It's a permanent exhibit, but is designed to evolve and change as space exploration happens. 